The scroll cannot leave Rome. Kill anyone who tries. Even our own? It speaks of fire and of a savior with blood in his past. You mean me? <sighs> Hand over the scroll, traitor. Then come and take it. Only the worthy may unlock its final line. And if I'm not? You swore an oath to Rome. No, Marcus. I swore to justice. Lucius! Ah! Ah! The scroll! Protect it! Not without you. Fight for the scroll. Fight for her. Fight for Rome. It says Rome will rise only when the blood of tyrants feeds its roots. Then let's water the tree. Rome is not yours. Rome belongs to its people. So guys, we've all been hearing about Google VO3, the AI video tool that's currently trending online. I decided to create a video to help people understand exactly how it works and how to use it more effectively. In this tutorial, I'll show you step by step how to generate cinematic quality videos using this powerful AI tool. Now, I want you to stick close and watch carefully as I walk you through the entire process. The truth is, AI is really transforming the way we create content online, and if you're not already using it, you're missing out. Let's begin with the Google document I've prepared. Inside, you'll find two sections, section A and section B. Each contains different prompt styles you can use for video generation. To start, I'll copy the first prompt from section A, head over to ChatGPT, paste it in, and hit enter. If you're not yet using AI tools like ChatGPT, now is the time to start. And if you'd like personal mentorship, feel free to use the email in the description below to contact me directly. I offer YouTube mentorship, and unlike just giving you a static video course, I provide live webinars, where I guide you one-on-one. -on -one. This blend of live sessions and structured learning makes a big difference. Now, once we paste the prompt into ChatGPT, it asks us to define a few things for our scene generation, such as who the characters are, their appearance, age, species, if not human, clothing, mood, and so on. It even gives examples, like a weathered bounty hunter in his 40s with a cybernetic eye and a voice like gravel. For our test, I typed in two characters are man of 40 years and a woman of 30 year stalking to each other in shining armor. Include dialogue. ChatGPT then generated a full cinematic scene following these structured steps. Character description, setting and time of day, camera direction, sound design and music, dialogue, the final output was beautifully formatted with scene, tone, mood, and even suggested titles and prompts. I needed a complete prompt and then I asked ChatGPT to generate the prompt for me and it did exactly just that. Next, I copied that entire result and headed over to Google VO3. On the VO3 interface, look at the bottom left corner where you'll find the text-to-video and frames-to-video options. We're going to use the text-to-video feature. Then, on the right-hand side, click on the settings icon. You'll see different video model versions, VO2, VO3, etc. I selected VO3 fast, text-to-video, for this demo. After pasting in the prompt I got from ChatGPT, I chose to generate just one video. This helps conserve my credits since the platform usually gives you about 1,000 credits to start with. You can set how many videos you want to generate in the options below the prompt field. The result? Stunning. The video VO3 generated was incredibly cinematicit, transported us back to the Roman Empire, complete with ancient visuals and atmospheric tone. Let's listen to the video. We won, but not without losing more than we ever counted on. Victory always asks for blood, but I never thought it would take your heart too. The mouth movements, facial expressions, and overall quality 
looked like something shot by a professional filmmaker. Now that we've completed section A, we're going to head back to the Google document and copy the prompt from section B. Once we have that, we'll return to ChatGPT and paste the prompt in. As you'll see, ChatGPT will generate a full cinematic action story for us. In this case, the title it gave is Ghost Protocol. From there, ChatGPT breaks the story into several scenes and each scene includes detailed elements like the setting and time, visual mood, camera direction, sound design, and even dialogue. This structure makes creating high-quality cinematic content much easier. For the purpose of this tutorial, we're going to select just four scenes from the full prompt and use them to generate video clips. I'll go ahead and copy the first scene's prompt and head straight into Google VO3. I'll paste the prompt into the text-to-video generator and proceed. Then, I'll repeat the same process for the next three scenes. Google VO3 allows you to generate multiple videos, one for each individual scene. Now let's take a look at what the AI has generated for us. We've got four separate cinematic clips. The first scene, the second scene, the third scene, and finally, the fourth scene. This shows that you can actually generate an entire movie sequence using this AI tool, scene by scene. Let me go ahead and play the videos so you can watch how each one turned out. You're not the only one looking for her. Then they'd better move faster. She wiped the logs, but left this on purpose. She's drawing me in. You still think I betrayed you? You vanished. What else was I supposed to think? To believe me. So guys, looking at the video we've just generated, if you want to continue building the story from this point, here's exactly what to do. Once your video is done rendering, click on the Add to Scene on the top right-hand side of the video, and a timeline showcasing where to add more scenes to your video will open up. Simply hover over the bottom toolbar and click on the plus icon. When the options appear, choose Extend. This allows you to seamlessly continue the scene or storyline from where it left off. Now, at the point where you want to extend the video, you'll be prompted to paste in a new prompt. For example, let's head back to ChatGPT, copy Scene 5's prompt, and then return to Google VO3. Paste the prompt into the extension field, click Generate, and let the AI do its magic. In just a short while, Google VO3 will generate an extended segment of your video continuing the storyline smoothly based on the input you provided. You can keep repeating this process adding new prompts and extending Senesto create a fully fleshed out cinematic movie using just AI tools. Now let's take a look at the latest scene we generated. I'll go ahead and hit play so you can see how it flows with the earlier scene. Personally, I'm really impressed with how well the AI blended the first scene into the new one. The transitions are seamless and the story continues without any jarring cuts it truly feels like part of the same movie. I hope this walkthrough was clear and helpful. If it was, please make sure to subscribe to the channel, hit the like button, and share this video so others can benefit from it as well. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.